All right. Welcome to today's stream. We're doing it again. Advent of Code 2022. And uh, yeah, this was fun last year. It's been fun the year before that. And it's going to be fun again. We're doing Advent of Code in Haskell. And uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. You can see I haven't opened the code yet. I did make a, well, not a repo, but um, short uh, a module where I'm going to be working on. And uh, yeah. So let's get started. Let's see what today's task is. All right. Calorie counting. Uh, Santa's reindeer typically eat regular reindeer food, but they need a lot of magical energy to deliver presents on Christmas. For that, their favorite snack is a special type of star fruit that only grows deep in the jungle. I also brought you on their annual expedition to the grove where the fruit grows. To supply enough actual energy, the expedition needs to retrieve a minimum of 50 stars by December 25th. Although the elves assure you that the grove has plenty of fruit, you decide to grab any food you see along the way, just in case. Wow. So, they just won't fly. That's a big much, huh? Alright, let's see. Collect stars by solving puzzles. Two puzzles will be made available in each shape. In the the calendar. The second puzzle unlock when you complete the first. Each puzzle... Each puzzle... Uh, grants one star. Good luck. Okay, now for today's task, right? Oh, we got a viewer! We went up to like 100 viewers, I think, at one point last year. But, it all starts with that one viewer, right? So, uh, the elves take... The jungle must be too overgrown and difficult to navigate in vehicles or, or, or access from the air. The elves' expedition traditionally goes on foot. As uh, your boats approach land, the elves begin taking inventory of their supplies. One important consideration is food, in particular, the number of calories each elf is carrying. Uh, your puzzle input. Your elves must take turns writing down the number of calories contained by the various meals, snacks, rations, etc. that they brought with them, one item per line. Each elf s separates their own inventory from the previous elf's inventory, if any, by a blank line. Okay, so they write the following list. And then the first elf is carrying food with 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, a total of 600 calories. And so is that then one item, then 11,000. Okay, so we're just adding up these numbers. Okay. The elves get hungry and need extra snacks. They need to know which elf to ask. They'd like to know how many calories are being carried by the elf carrying the most calories. In the example above, this is 24,000 uh, carried by the fourth elf. Find the elf carrying the most calories. How many total calories is that elf carrying? All right, so let's grab the example and let's plop it down here uh, in. Uh, let's see. Oh my God. Where do I connect to? Let's uh, add a file. Call it. Um, Save it. This is going to be example. All right. Uh, now we're going to say uh, so. Read input is going to take. Uh, it's going to take a string, uh, and then it's going to give us an IO, and it's going to return a list of lists of ints. Okay. Uh, uh, read input file name equals, and I always forget uh, how to do this every single year. Uh, let me see. So, uh, wait, can, I can do this, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, so let's see. Um, GHCI, uh, we're running 9.2 here. Oh, hey! Hey, little Lenny. 
my biggest fan wearing one of your t-shirts t-shirts all right so i'll say read file what is the type of that uh-huh so this gives us a string so let's say do f file it's gonna be read file file name okay this one is actually file f yeah file path okay do file read file file name and then we want to split oh thor's hammer clearly anti and bed oh yeah i have to say at the yeah i should also say all these things uh, i announced it on twitter but i think um I think I should announce it on uh, um, on uh, like types. Oh, Fabian is here. Ah, see, the gang's all getting together again. I like it. Okay, let's see. Uh, so we read the file name. Uh, okay, and then we do. I think uh, split D split at. Uh, T span. Yeah, so this one gives us, um, doc span. Yeah, so it returns a tuple while the first element is the longest prefix of the uh, elements that satisfy. And, uh, oh, let me actually go into settings here. Uh, settings and i remember i needed to do this before terminal uh fonts right and i need to change the font of the terminal yeah this is better so you guys can read it at home all right uh wow well, the haskell hum is out right okay so we take a so we have a list of lists so this is going to be just a list, right? Okay, and then... Uh, let proc. So we are going to cut it into a list of lists. Uh, lists of lists. Let me see. This is going to take a list of strings and go give me a list of list of strings. Okay. So list of lists equals, uh, so empty is just going to be empty. List of lists. Uh, how am I going to do this? So I want to take the span, right? Like kind of in a loop. So I want to do, um, so, so I'm going to do, um, you know, span and then equals. Uh, no, so this is going to be not equals space, right? Um, okay, so let a else equals. Uh, so else of empty is empty else of uh, x is equals uh, where uh, x comma y is equal to span not equals not equals of x's so then this is going to be the elf and it's going to be the rest okay so this is going to be um, x uh, elves of y okay uh, and then let's just print a uh, elves of file so let's just see what this is main io main equals read input a example okay now let's see here ghc what do you say ah sad to be not able to do Bit of code, but it's also good to be busy. Hopefully, you're doing something uh, uh, well, more useful. Ah, but it's fun. Huh? There's no main module. Ah. Oh, you didn't open. 
in the oh this is not the AC twenty two day one there we go uh-huh uh right return empty uh all right we need to return here also like that we keep doing control x control s right because uh, I was doing a lot of emacs in a bit. Huh. Oh yeah, it's not not equal this way, it's the Haskell not equals. Okay. There we go. Um well, it's taking a long time to compile. Let's compile it, okay. Ah uh, Right. Uh so I need to do lines of this right uh, so it's gonna be all right so else uh -huh. so it's actually gonna be like this I think oh wait mm-hmm <laughs> Ah, this is not going well. Ah, so, oh, this is... X's, yeah, and then span... Oh, maybe if it uh, ends in a... I think like a file ends in the empty like no print file let's just uh, see what we're actually getting here yeah okay so we get a list of strings and then the empty string oh and then uh all right i think i need to Because it will return like the first non-empty element. Like this, right? Ah. Okay. Uh, right. <sighs> okay. So we will take the X and then so it ends up with the empty one. Okay, let's just do here. Uh, case Y of Probably a better way to do this. Hmm. Okay. I think maybe I'm misunderstanding this uh, span function. Oh, span. So it takes and then returns. Tupo, okay. Uh, right. Mm. Uh, okay, yeah. So here, Something like that, yeah. So now I'm throwing away the element that's empty. Yeah. All right. So now we got the list of lists. Okay. Uh, and then let's enable that which 
type applications. Okay, now we go GTI and say doc a read, right? Uh, so what I'm gonna do here is I am going to return map read at hint uh, map okay I'm gonna map over the files of elves elves file we got it all right uh, let's see what we get here Oh, right. um, no, I'm not being too much. All right. And now we got it. Okay. So now we have the input in a nice way. Okay. So um, they'd like to ask how many calories are being carried by the elf carrying the most calories. Okay, so, uh, prob1 takes a list, a list of ints, and returns an int. So we do prob1 equals, uh, so, cals equals, so we're going to map sum over it, and then we're going to say maximum. Okay, let's just say that it's, uh, print up prob one I think it's like this. yeah all right 24,000 right so let's get our puzzle input um, we get a new file paste it save it load it input um, and then we change this to be input. Six seven oh two seven. Uh, I should not print the file. Okay, let's uh, paste it. All right, we got part one. Woo -woo. Let's actually not run it just like this just actually do it you know that's user bin and, um, okay wait can i make time give me like milliseconds uh user bin time milliseconds um Takes uh, 0 0.01 seconds. So 10 milliseconds, I guess. Alright, now let's do problem two. Ugh. Mm. Little Annie has so many like annotations. Um Yeah. Let's see. By the time you calculate the answer to the else questions, they already realized that the elf carrying the most calories of food might eventually run out of snacks. Uh, the total carriage carried by top three L uh, carrying the most calories. That way, even if one of those elements are... Uh, throw up three L, the fourth elf, the third elf, and then the fifth elf. Okay. Uh, so, we do like this. Um, now let's uh, actually just copy this in here. Now, um, now let's see what we can do with the example. Let me write prop two. So now we're just gonna 
map sum and then sort and then take three and then we're gonna sum over that oh no ah What are you talking about data kinds here? Illegal type. Oh. Import data.list sort. Why is sort not in the prelude anymore? Uh, right. So we need to reverse it also. Okay, 45,000 we get for the example. Now let's do it for the input. Let's see. Seven two nine one. It's like that number in the, the eight crumb. All right, we did day one. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, it's a short one today. Mostly, uh, yeah. I was just setting things up, seeing if they worked. I figured out two things. Number one, I need. Uh, to fix my uh, uh, keyboard cam, uh, so it it works, but it keeps freezing. So I need to do something about that. Uh, and then, yeah, I need to because uh, I have like the chat view here, but I need to make it more zoomed in. I think I need to go to like Twitch. Uh, and then Twitch. Let me see if I can just figure this out now because I have you here. And then you can send a message, and uh, you can uh, think of me. Then we've got Babu Yeti for Kaiwano Punkus uh, from Civilization. I want to go to channel. Oh, she's on live. Oh. From Civilization. Let me pause. Uh, there's like the. Where's that interface for the studio? Creator dashboard. Yes, that's the one. Chat highlights, uh-huh. Okay, now I'm gonna take my chat and I'm gonna pop it out. Okay, yeah, and now it is actually huge. Ah, now I can read. And now I can look at you guys in the eyes. Uh, and I can see what you're saying. Let me just say something here. Hey, all. Wow, amazing stuff. No, this is because uh, I got my, um, I have my setup, right? So I got my teleprompter. All right, so that was it for today. Uh, quick and easy, right? Not much happening, but thanks for tuning in. And uh, yeah, I'll see you same time tomorrow, six o'clock. Um, and uh, yeah. Yeah, we, we're doing this. We're doing it this year. All right. Thank you for tuning in again. And uh, catch you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Ah, have to transition. All right. Bye-bye.